Tourism is one of the strategic sectors of the economy of Uzbekistan. 86 countries to date enjoy a visa-free regime with the country, while citizens of 53 countries can get their visas electronically. However, against the background of the pandemic, it is this sector that has suffered the most. Measures to restore and develop the country's tourism potential were on the agenda of a regular meeting chaired by President Shavkat Mirziyoyev on December 9. Uzbekistan plans to attract 1.7 million foreign and 7.5 million local tourists in 2021, as well as increase the export of services in the sector to 370 million US dollars. According to Mirziyoyev, pilgrimage tourism is one of the most promising directions that deserve attention. Uzbekistan has hundreds of Muslim shrines, monuments of Judaism and Buddhism. Taking advantage of this opportunity, the country could attract 700,000 pilgrims and ensure the export of services worth 130 million US dollars. The president pointed out the need for a gradual resumption of air links with European countries, Malaysia, Indonesia, Pakistan, Thailand, Japan, and the launch of new destinations for pilgrimage tourism from next year. He also criticized the high cost of tickets of the national air career and gave instructions to reduce prices. He noted the lack of work to promote pilgrimage tourism and scientific approach. Instructions were given to simplify the visa system for citizens of countries where pilgrimage tours to Uzbekistan are in high demand. Moreover, Mirziyoyev also ordered to extend the benefits and preferences granted to the tourism industry amid the pandemic until the end of 2021.